How's it? This is my Savage. There's many like it, but this is my Mighty Mouse because I own it. How's it, Grasshopper? Today's sugar time is um, making an improvised, custom made, a gold headspace gauge for my Mighty Mouse Southern Death Way. So, a uh, disclaimer. Me, myself, and I is not responsible for your mess up, your misunderstanding, or everything, anything that's not covered. So if you want to try, you will be at your own peril. This is for your information only. Poops on giggles only. If you want to switch out your barrels, make sure you have professional equipment. For uh, this block of instruction, you need new cases. So uh, what I did was I pulled the um, bullets off the uh, loaded ammo using the, this bullet puller. And yes, this bullet puller has seen better days. Next step is to uh, adjust the sizing die, and this is the uh, Lyman 223 Remington sizing die. In order to uh, adjust the sizing die, first you bring the ram all the way up with the uh, shot holder in place, and then you screw down until it touches. Do not force it. As you see uh, on the die that I already made a mark a long time ago where it touches the bottoms out. And then tighten the uh, lock nut, hand tight. And after that, lower the arm and then turn in. One third, uh, correction, one eighth for no more sizing the uh, fire cases. However, I'm making an uh, improvised custom gold headspace gauge. So therefore, what I'm going to do is I'm going to align the mark on the die to the third mark that I made. So from here to there is one eighth turn and then there is a one quarter turn. As you can see, you saw it, it's not uh, that much at all. So now, this setting here is for the uh, making the headspace gauge. This is the mark that I was talking about right here. After the uh, sizing die is adjusted, now I'm going to use um, Lee sizing um, lubricant. Yes, it has seen better days too. All it needs is um, a little bit to size the case. That's probably too much. In order to do a good, um, or make a good improvised uh, custom um, go head space gauge, you need to have either the C or O frame type uh, press. A third press will not work because it, it rocks back and forth and then um, I'm going to size the uh, new case which I pulled by the way uh, these rounds are range find so um, I'm using it as it is and uh, if you can well you have to avoid the rounds with the uh, dents on the shoulders. It's not good. This is not uh, good either. Because of this. Um, uh, you got to remember the headspace um, is on the uh, shoulder. So if you have um, a dented case like this. It might throw off your um, headspace. 
So once it's um, lubed, again, and put it into dye. And after the um, case has been uh, sized, make sure that the um, this is um, over length is not um, past the maximum length. Clean the case off. And measure the case. It's at a maximum length, 4460. This is how I made my uh, improvised custom go head space gauge for my body mouth for switch barrels. And also don't forget to set this die, sizing die back to the original position. How many uh, you make is up to you. I made 20. And uh, you might ask me again, um, how did it work out? Well, I still got my trigger finger and the cutie face and my mighty mouth. This is my mighty mouth. There's many like it, but this one is mine because I own it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.